Hey, this is Kristen with Drive Mode Show. And this is Jill Simonello with Pickup Truck Plus SUV Talk. And here we have Miles Johnson, Senior Manager of PR for Hyundai yes. America. And, and, and the guy that we go to when we need something for Ravel. Everything that was done on the truck was kind of an extracurricular activity for all the staff members. So um, the design team contributed to the vehicle wrap. The guys in the service garage on their spare time with the help of an engineer by the name of Eric Buxton did all the modifications. So the lift kit, the max tracks, the mounts, um, Rally Innovations helped install all this stuff. So it's a truly been a labor of love to watch uh, them put this on the road and then they're gonna give it another go. And what really impressed me was how quickly they decided to give it another go at the <laughs> end of the, the rally last year. At the finish line, I'm like, next year. And she was like, mm. I think Kristen needed a little bit more. I said, give me a minute. I just need to, yes, I just need to process this. Because people say to me all the time, and I know they say it to you too, that sounds so fun. I'm like, well, fun isn't the word I'd use, but, but it was an epic adventure and challenge. And yeah. we're so grateful to Hyundai for backing us up from the start. You know, I, I had a tremendous amount of time just learning about what it was, and you guys were always asking, oh, we got to do this training, and we need this, <laughs> and we need that, and then I was like, okay, and they didn't really have a concept of what it was until we started getting the footage back. Right. And it really is a learning experience on how to navigate those trails and roads, but the mapping, orienteering part of it, I guess, seems very stressful. That's the hardest, that's the hardest part, no doubt. And some of the pictures I could tell the, the decision making. We're focused. <laughs> yeah, yeah we're heads, very focused. Heads down, like, let's not get lost. I'm assuming that's what's going to well, sure, yeah, yeah, we did not want to get lost, but sometimes yeah. we did have to make a decision, like, do we think this is this? And Jill yeah. and I had very different navigation styles. Yeah. Jill is very meticulous about every tiny millimeter like this is this represents a, a tenth of a kilometer and 1.2345648324 kilometers five. <laughs> yeah. there will be a road right there right that'd be jill and i would say well you know i think it's in this general area and we're going to see this feature and it's going to look like this so i see it it's one way and jill sees it another way but together yeah, we actually did really well out. that worked very well for us i think it and, did. and so like we switched back and forth this past year navigator and driver oh, but okay. um a change well, well no but like we, we went back and forth every other day but even when i was driving and she was navigating you would ask me does this look like or how is yeah. this and then you know, when I was driving, I'd be like, oh, does it look like we can make it through that? And like, so we really worked as a team to spot each other and help each other out. And then when the rules were reversed, we did the same thing. And so I think it was very helpful for us to know both sides. Okay. Very nice. So TBD on I if we're going to switch rules yeah, we'll or we're going to hold, hold our, hold our rules. So I'm curious. Sure. I'm curious to know what it was like behind the scenes at Hyundai headquarters as you were watching us and getting footage every day, like, <laughs> what were you thinking? What were you, was it like, were you cheering? Were there people well, like, what the heck are they doing? The cheering was coming, but then I was always in my mind, like <laughs> the near miss, like it's gotta be here. Like, and that feeling you guys would have, but, oh. <laughs> We're, we're lost or yeah. whatever. When we, like, I think Eric said he watched us one day when we were lost in the yeah, wash. Yeah. I was navigating. It was me. I'm the problem. Um, but but we literally went back and forth. And he was yeah. like, I literally, he's like, I didn't know if it was stuck on repeat or what was going on. I was like, no, no, we were literally driving back and forth. Yeah, they cloned so, the video footage. But <laughs> having a year under your belt will be good, right? And then yes. the future can be very bright for where you go next, right? Future will be bright. We'll have to wear shades. We'll have I to like wear that. shades. Okay, so last question for me, Miles, is what do, you know, as people in Hyundai learned about what you were doing with the Rebel Rally, like what were people saying about it? What, what do people think about this program? I think the response from the design team was the best. Um, we have some of the best designers in the world, so for them to sit down and come up with a creative brief for the actual designer of the car mm -hmm. designed the wrap. Uh. So to have that person give his thought and attention to detail to it, 
and give the assignment to some of the other designers to come up with some concepts is really exciting. And then also the effort on the garage and I went part shopping for you guys at least three times. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You different. Did. And but I've always loved racing and rally and one of my first goals at Hyundai was to get Hyundai involved in racing back in two thousand five and we did Formula Drift, we mm -hmm. did Rally Cross and now we're in IMSA and we're doing this project. So yeah, the racing stuff in North America is bright and this was a fun opportunity. I really enjoyed working on it. Well, so you brought up the wrap and I've actually had a couple of people ask me like what this symbology was. Like what what was going on with like the Paisley design? Like is like I think they used a bandana okay. that they had found for the inspiration mm -hmm. on the the pattern. Okay. From a bandana and then I think they took the desert theme on the colors with the yep. the green and the brown. And the and, constellations yeah. and, and the then sky. And then they went as far as to make sure the wheels and the, the wrap matched. So the attention to detail was really good. And then you guys came up with the logo, or your sister came up with the logo, which was super fun. Yeah. And yeah, it really worked out well. So I, I'm going to ask you a question okay. that you will probably say I can't, I can't talk about that, but I'm going to ask you okay. anyway. Um, we did a lot of stuff to this truck. We put a lift on it. There's a skid plate on there. There's, um, you know, roof uh, racks. There's the bed rack. Have you guys given any consideration to potentially putting any of these items on future products? Well, some of the accessories I know did come from Hyundai. Yes. And a lot of them are in the aftermarket uh, with some suppliers. So I think that is growing with inside of Hyundai. <laughs> That's a good PR answer. And then, <laughs> but we're always very protective of the warranties on the new right. vehicles. So you have to be cautious what you're allowing people to do. Right. Um, you certainly don't want to damage the vehicle in any way. But in terms of capability, I mean, it's a great V6 engine. It's a good transmission yep. for what you're doing. And then I like the body style. It's, it's an SUV inside, right? but you have a nice box in the back to do uh, what you need to do as far as the dirty stuff and all the equipment you guys have back in there and the shovels right. and all that yep. stuff. So I personally think this would be a great starting place for an XRT version of the Santa Cruz. I'm just going to put that out there for you. Noted. <laughs> just just going to put that Noted. out there. Noted. <laughs> I think that wraps up the questions yeah. that I had. Okay. All the questions we have, we are so thankful for Hyundai and we're excited yeah, about 2023. I think you guys have a training coming up. So. We, do. we do. We do. Here we go. So let's do a quick Brute Squad oh, pose. Yeah. Okay.